Friends and family, welcome. Today is a special day in the lives of these two individuals that we all love very much. I hope that as you guys take a mental snapshot today and you see everybody that's here and they're here to support you, that you will never forget the faces that are in this crowd. And because Rick and Dana believe that God has led them to each other as part of his wonderful plan for their lives and his desire is to join them, today we will celebrate the joining of two into one in marriage. And the desire of this couple is to affirm their vows to each other and before God in your presence. A lot of talks, a lot of conversations, a lot of prayer, um, a lot of getting to know each other to realize that they were right for each other. Sometimes it takes having a lot of differences, but the similarities that really unify you to make a relationship work. Amen. Not about, Amen. not always agreeing with everything. It's okay to disagree. It's okay to agree to disagree. Um, what's important is listening to one another. Um, knowing where you stand and accepting your past and present and bringing it to your future. Rick and Dana, you're about to pledge the most sacred vows that one person makes with another. And so as you stand here before God and these witnesses, please give careful consideration to that which you are promising. You are accountable to each other, to all those who are here, and to God for that which you pledge. And so I ask, Rick, do you take Dana to be your wife, to have and to hold, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish permanently from this day forward? Dana, do you take Rick to be your husband, to have and to hold, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish permanently from this day forward? Definitely do. Rick is one of the hardest working, humble, down-to-earth guys that I've ever met. If I were to describe one of Rick's best traits, it would be his ability to get along with everyone. He can interact with anyone one time and they remember him for a lifetime. He knows all of his neighbors and his bartenders. <laughs> I'm lucky to call the two of you two of my best friends. Rick, repeat after me these words. Dana. Dana. You are the woman for whom I prayed. You are the woman for whom I prayed. To be my wife. To be my wife. My companion. My companion. And my best friend. And my best friend. I give you this ring. I give you this ring. As a symbol of my faithful love to you. As a symbol of my faithful love to you. And thereby seal. And thereby seal. This God created marriage. This God created marriage. Rick. Rick. You're the man for whom I prayed. You're the man for whom I prayed. To be my husband. To be my husband. My partner. My partner. My companion. My companion. And my best friend. And my best friend. From this day forward. From this day forward. Joyfully and willingly. Joyfully and willingly. I give you this ring. I give you this ring. As a symbol of my pledge. As a symbol of my pledge. A faithful love to you. A faithful love to you. And thereby seal. And thereby seal. This God created marriage. This God created marriage. So Rick and Dana, we have witnessed the sealing of your marriage covenant by the exchanging of vows and the giving of rings, thereby affirming once and for all what God has already done. So by the power of his word and in view of what you have done before God and these witnesses, I pronounce that from this moment forward, you are husband and wife. <laughs> I, as well as everyone here, are excited to see you begin this new chapter of your lives. Rick, we are thrilled to have you join our family and to join our family group chat. <laughs> you guys have the best forward to it all the time. <laughs> I got, I got introduced literally the next day, so oh my gosh. New group chat coming tomorrow. So yeah, congrats to you both. Cheers. Dana, we know you're in good hands, and we know Rick makes you very happy and brings out the best in you. And I can't wait to see what life has in store for both of you together. <laughs> always, always stick up for one another, always have each other's back, apologize early and often, Learn to turn the other cheek, speak each other's love language. Don't go to bed angry because inevitably you will wake up angry too. It's true. Swallow your pride and remember you can never say I love you too many times. Bring it in.